Welcome viewers, this is Green Guy Tarot and this is your Libra October Tarot Prediction Reading. Really sorry for the delay, I was away and then I was kind of unwell so I couldn't post or do the readings. Thank you again for your patience. Let's begin the reading with the Tarot and then we'll follow your Oracle cards. Airy, oh sorry, Libra, your first card is two of wands. Ne oh, pardon me. Next you have nine of wands. Then you have, pardon me for the noise so much, page of pentacles. Next you have nine of swords then you have the ace of cup and the final card is the world card the only major arcana that you got libra all of the other zodiacs got many major arcanas but you have just one i can see throughout the month libras the energies are going up and down so much happening and so much fluctuation of energies let's begin the first card is the two of wands so it is high time for you to get out of your comfort zone and pursue what you are passionate about this can be love situation this can be work whatever it is it is not going to happen wishing and hoping you need to take action you need to get out and work on things more the next card to the two of wands is the nine of wands this is the card that tells yes there are past or there were past traumas and disappointing situation that is stopping you but you need to progress forward because stagnation is not something that is going to be fruitful to have the goals coming into fusion you need to get out of the stagnation break free from the past baggage and move on the next card to the nine of wands is the page of pentacles this is the card that is telling you to have more enthusiastic approach towards your financial goals you just sitting quietly or thinking about things will not be resolve the situations you need to take action and you need to have a lot more energy your next card is nine of swords this is the card that tells there is a strong need for you to let go of worries and how can you do so you need to have more details informations as you have more information you will be able to relax and work on things better there is something in your headspace that is bothering you or maybe multiple things in your headspace that are bothering you and in this month you need to break free from it i can sense the energy is heavy and you are struggling but trust me only you can free yourself from all this your next card is the ace of cups this is the card that tells about the need for you to follow your creative ideas you need to trust your intuition more answer your inner calling abundance will come love will come but for that you need to get out get out of your head get out of your space and find and build beautiful things you can see in the world card this person is kind of liberated from the past heaviness you can see it 
feels like this person is coming out of something and they are happy and this is going to be you once you are done with all the things that was stopping you and only you can do this and you need to do this now as you will be able to successfully close all the chapters that were due you will be healing faster you will be progressing more so this was the tarot for you let's see what we have for you in the auto cards okay the first card is envy this is the card that tells that there are envious energies that from other people or maybe it's you if this is from other people definitely be careful with whom you are sharing information if it is you please do not compare everything you are doing it is according to your life and everything everyone else is doing that's according to their life you must not compare you must not feel envious everyone have a different syllabus a different question paper and they are giving the exam let's see what we have for you next indecision that's why you need to trust your intuition and your knowledge more and it will be really really important there will be times when you need to take decisions for sure and you answering the call of your intuition will help you transform and thrive better your next card yes is the cornucopia as you choose and decide the right way you will find your cornucopia okay <laughs> and the caring connection so there is love there is abundance there is so much for you to be grateful practice gratitude every day and enjoy life more let's see what we have next for you love and caring connection is definitely there and now you need to understand what do you need to release you need to release the past new things will come if you are able to clear the space for them if you are too hung up on the things that were there previously or if you are holding the, them too tightly you are too attached to it it is toxicity you need to let that go you need to give time and permission to your self to heal and that will bring in the new things in your life let's see what's next a fiery climax approaches so there will be things that will be done once in for all but it is not going to go down quietly there will be some fiery approaches or better say fiery displays that will come into place but you need to be done with them you better need to be done with them rather than carrying them around let's see what else is there you are never alone love is there so there is someone who cares about you who loves you they are definitely being by your side maybe you are kind of too busy and not getting the picture or they haven't expressed their love in the words but maybe they are here with a friend and as you were too busy with things they don't want to bother you kind of that situation is going on whatever it is you need to understand that look around be open for possibilities let's see what's there next 
the next card is turn knowledge into wisdom so life teach you lessons every day so you need to turn those everyday lessons everyday knowledge into wisdom you need to keep those learnings into the book and let go of the trauma and that will help you grow mature and progress let's see what's next bring your ideas to life don't suppress them don't ignore them it's time to bring your ideas to life take action don't just be busy in your mind get out of it you can do this this is all that is required from you now you just need to act if you don't you might lose the opportunities that are here for you let's see what's next transformation is beautiful change is beautiful it may be uncomfortable as we all know when the caterpillar thinks that everything is ending butterfly emerges so you need to give chance to the change you need to embrace the change you need to proceed forward don't hesitate just proceed forward let's see what else is there mending yes there is a need of recovery whatever needed your extra attention care you need to give it now you need to mend the situations sometimes some struggles and challenges damages things damages sorry damages relations situations what can we do for them we can give extra care nurture back it to the help to the good to the goodness maybe it is something that is kind of there and you are busy and not noticing it and it is going to rot if you don't turn your mind around and take care of it mend it nurture it let it thrive this can be you this can be your relation this can be anything in your life that needs your attention focus get out of your head your next card is time for a nap yes prioritize self care rest and rejuvenation is needed there is a lot that you are handling and it is the time for you to take some time off rest rejuvenate and it is going to help you focus better in the future let's see the final card fork in the road so yes there will be situation when you need to choose decide and how can you do that you will be able to do that with knowledge not with the impulses let go of impulsive decision making you need to decide with knowledge you need to decide with experience you need to decide with your intuition your gut feeling and then things will work out in your best interest so libra this was your october tarot prediction reading if you like my reading please continue supporting my channel with like share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great october